We are live at the headquarters of the International Olympic Committee, the Olympic House in Lausanne, Switzerland. And with me in the Olympic House is the president of the IOC, Mr. Thomas Bach. Thank you very much. And uh, now it's my privilege uh, to announce uh, the athletes of uh, the IOC Refugee Olympic Team Tokyo uh, 2020. Swimming, Ala Maso. Jamal Abdul Majid. For the sport of shooting, Luna Solomon. Taekwondo, Dina Poryunas Longarudi. And wrestling, Aker Al Obaidi. So congratulations uh, to all of you. You are the IOC Refugee Olympic Team Tokyo 2020. And we are extremely proud of you. And uh, we thank you for all the energy you're bringing to uh, the Olympic community and to these uh, Olympic uh, Games. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. I'm very happy. I won't cry. Mama Tegla, uh, welcome again, and uh, how are you doing? You uh, gave me the trust to lead our uh, athletes as a mother, as a sister, as a sports person. You yourself as a sports person, Mr. President, I'm really honored to be the champion mission for the second time. First of all, congratulations. You know, many people have asked me, what do you expect of the refugee Olympic team? And my answer is simple. I expect you to win, to win medals. You have to, you have to compete like everybody else and be good as I know you are. But congratulations, really, for uh, having made it to this uh, important team. We're so proud of you. And remember, uh, dear friends, dear athletes, that uh, you have somehow an additional responsibility, not just to do well in the competitions, which is the primary task that you have in Tokyo, but also to represent and uh, make proud millions and millions of refugees and displaced people around the world that will be watching you and feel proud about what you will achieve. And now, now we are one team. We are the IOC Refugee Olympic Team.